We're very excited about the research that we've undertaken over the last year looking at the landscape for metastatic breast cancer patients. We looked at a number of different areas and so for example with scientific research, laboratory research and clinical trials we found through a very rigorous methodology that of all the private funding going to breast cancer research, only 7% is directed towards metastatic breast cancer research and there is not much coordination between uh, laboratories and clinical trials doing this work. So we are very excited about how we can increase the uh, coordination of funding and also perhaps the amount and um, how can we involve patients in the design of clinical trials so that other endpoints such as quality of life endpoints can be part of the trial experience beyond um, extending life. In terms of the epidemiology piece here in the United States, we don't have an accurate picture of how many women are living with metastatic breast cancer because of the way that they're counted um, in the data registries with the National Cancer Institute and, and individual states. And we have a very exciting project starting in 2015 with the National Cancer Institute and the SEER registries in a pilot project to look at improve how we collect data and information on people living with the disease. And we're also excited to look at how we can improve communication between uh, patients and their healthcare providers and their family and the broader public. And we will be working with a number of our partners on some trials, looking at how we can, uh, in, in for some of the underserved communities, improve communication between healthcare providers and patients who really struggle to understand at times the diagnosis and what their lives will be like now that they will be living a life of treatment. Uh, and so these are the, some of the um, initiatives that we're all very excited about and uh, we'll be working on hard in 2015 and 2016. The best way for individuals and organisations to become involved with the Metastatic Breast Cancer Alliance is to go to our website www.mbcalliance.org and click on the contact button and send all their requests through to me directly through that button. They can also follow us on our Facebook page which is facebook.com NBC Alliance and we do post a lot of information about what we as an alliance and also our members are doing through the Facebook page. So two great ways to get information about the alliance. Do you know that not every breast cancer patient needs chemotherapy? Now there's a way to decide if chemotherapy will benefit you based on the unique biology of your tumor. To learn more about the Oncotype DX test, and how to discuss it with your doctor, click this button.